Hey, what's going on guys? Jake the Happy Snake here, and welcome to part 76 of Pokemon Emerald. Last time I rematched Sydney and Phoebe. This time I am going to rematch Glacia, Drake, and Champion Wallace. Now originally I didn't plan on rematching Wallace in this video, but after thinking about it for a bit, I decided that it would be better this way, so that is why I am going to do it this way. But anyways, let's go ahead and get this party started with Glacia. So, first things first, I'm going to take the amulet coin away from Nightmare, and I'm going to give it to Voltzer. Move Voltzer to the front, because she starts out with Celio. So, yeah. But anyways, here we go. So, yeah, this should be pretty easy. I had, no, I had no trouble with her at all the first time around, so the second time should be even easier. Celios are really fat, aren't they? I mean, they're not as fat as Wallerain, obviously. Anyways, uh, Glalie, no problem. Oh look, my laptop actually has a purpose in the Elite Four! Yeah, this is like... I mean, after this point, my laptop is, uh... It really it doesn't have much, uh... It doesn't really have much time to shine. Like, I, I don't really... I, I don't need to use her at all against Drake or Wallace. So yeah, after uh, after I kill both of her Glalies, my laptop is pretty much useless for the rest of the, the rest of the Elite Four, which is kind of annoying, and that's why she's the lowest level out of all of my, out of any of my Pokemon. And Wallerain, yeah, Wallerain is way fatter than Celio. I mean, look look at that thing. If I ever had a Wallerain. If I, if, I, if I ever caught a feel for whatever reason, I was actually going to use a Waller right now, I know exactly what I would nickname it. I would nickname it Waza. Uh, um, after the Wallers from Banjo-Kazooie. Yeah, I'm not really the best with coming up with, with nicknames for Pokemon, but Pokemon like that, it's pretty easy. And say same thing with, like, Bear Tick. If I ever use a Bear Tick in, like, Black and White or whatever, I would call it Boggy after the Polar Bear in Banjo-Kazooie. Anyways, after killing her second Celio, Vulture gets a level 60. That's awesome. Now it's up to my laptop. Oh, why not? Pretty sure a flamethrower. Uh, yeah, pretty sure. I'm pretty sure a flamethrower would kill it, but whatever. Two thousand eighty-three. Wow, I'll be eighty-five years old in, in that year. Anyways, that was super easy. It took me less than four minutes. Yeah, that's why I. Uh, that's why I don't, I don't like battling just one Elite Four member in one video because it's like the shortest video ever. Okay, moving on to Drake. Uh, I will go with Emily. You know what I could, you know what actually maybe hmm I should try sweeping this guy's team with just Emily because I can do that that would def definitely be possible I'm gonna try that see if I can sweep sweep this guy's team with just Emily all right Drake come on man it's the middle of January why do you not have a shirt on like I know you're wearing like a Sailor's coat or whatever you call it, but like man put on a shirt. It's the middle of January for goodness sakes. Okay, first things first Of course you're gonna use protect. Why didn't I think of that? Of course you're gonna use it again Why am I so stupid Actually, I it's kind of like um, Phoebe's dust like it doesn't always you try using protect protect twice in a row 
Like it's a guaranteed to use it, well, like the, the, the first turn, which is why I shouldn't have used Ice Beam the first turn. But um, it's not always guaranteed to do it twice in a row. I know one time I was battling uh, Phoebe's Dusclops. I think I actually mentioned, I might have mentioned this in the last video, and or maybe when I battled her the first time. But one time her Dusclops used for me her Dusclops used Protect like five times in a row, and it actually worked. And I don't understand how. And I'll never forget that. Actually, I think it was four times, not five. But still, it was crazy. It was stupid. Anyways, my Altaria is better than yours. Level 59. Oh! Oh, Sky Attack. Wow, Sky Attack is a really good move. There's just one problem. I don't want to get rid of any of these moves. Actually, I would like to get rid of Sing, but... Man, I'm literally going to start catching legendaries in the next video. So I really, this is actually a terrible time to get rid of Sing. I like Ice Beam. Fly is very useful because I can go wherever I want. And I, I mean, Dragon Claw, I mean, come on, like, it's an Altaria. So, this is actually kind of stupid, but I'm actually not going to teach her Sky Attack. I could maybe at some point, maybe get rid of Fly. Go to the movie later, get rid of Fly, and then reteach her Sky Attack. I could do that. That's a really good move, though. I would recommend teaching. If you have a move that you don't, that, that you don't use, then get rid of that move and teach. A, and teach. A, if, you, if you have a Pokemon that's learned Sky Attack and you have a move that you have never used, then teach it Sky Attack because it, it is a good move. You basically, it's like fly. Actually, you charge up your your um. Except you, except you don't actually fly. You charge up like you just charge up the first turn and the next turn you attack. It has 140 power and I didn't see who was next, but it doesn't matter because I am planning on sweeping this guy with Emily anyway. So who cares? All right. But yeah, it's a good move, and if it wasn't for me n not liking Emily's moveset so much, then I would have I would have taught Sky Attack to her. It's just that I like her moveset too much, and I may might get rid of Fly, possibly, uh, for Sky Attack. But the thing is, though, there's not really a whole lot of, like, more battles, like actual battles that I'm planning on doing, um, because we're into the after game now, right? Like, I mean, yes, like, I'm going to be doing the legendary battles, but I mean, like, trainer battles against trainers. Like, there there's not really a whole lot left. Like, yeah, there's the gym leader rematches, and then there's another certain trainer that I don't want to mention right now. Um, but, I mean, that's really it. And I don't think I would need Sky Attack for any of those, so. Call me stupid, I don't care, but that's just what I want to do. Anyways, I've done really well with just using Emily on this guy. And last up is Kingdra. And normally, I would just use, send out my Swampert and use Earthquake on, the, on this uh, on Kingdra, but I actually have Dragon Claw. I move that's super effective against it. And he's... Oh, he's not going to heal. Oh, of course it missed! That's fine, I don't care. I still don't care. See? There we go, guys. I just swept Drake with Emily. Yeah. Hey, Drake, do you have a stepbrother named Josh? Anyways, Emily got up two levels that battle, which is pretty awesome. Superb, it should be said. 11,000. Wait, I didn't forget. No, no. Yeah, Emily's holding the amulet coin, right? Pretty sure she is. Yeah, she is. Okay. Okay, there we go. <clears throat> Voice crack. All right. So, um, next up is Wallace. So I'm going to be starting off with Wolster. And I really did go overkill on those items. Have I used any items at all in the Elite Four? I don't think so. Like, like in the, like in, in my second run, that is not, not not out of all together. But I don't think I've used. Have I used any of the items that I bought the la in the last video? I still have the same amount of hyper potions. Full heals, I'm good. Or maybe I used one. Do I have one more full heal somewhere? Because I know I had a hundred, but I'm not, I don't think a hundred actually shows in your bag. So it says ninety nine. There's a is there one more somewhere that I'm missing? Or maybe I did use one. Ninety nine full heals. Oh, I might have... Oh, there, okay, yeah. There's the other one, okay. So, yeah, I have, I, have a, I have 100 full heals. I have the same amount of revives, but hyper potions, full restores. I think that's it. Yeah, so I haven't used any items yet! Wow, I'm about to battle the champion. That's actually kind of cool. Okay, so what am I doing exactly? I don't know. I'm just kind of standing here in front of Drake. Um, oh, yeah, I was going to use a... I don't think I need to, but I'm going to use a paralyze... Do I have any paralyze heals? Just so I don't have to use any of my... 
100 full heals. I don't think I do actually have any paralyzed heals. Okay, that's fine. Then we'll use my, but we'll use this one, and there we go. Okay, guys, it is time to battle Champion Wallace for the second time. Oh man, I love this battle. So epic. And here we go. What's up, man? And guys, I swear to you, I when I have play through Emerald, guys, I I go through I battle the Elite Four over and over and over and over again, and I never get sick of it. That's that's my way of training in this game. So I'm probably probably gonna be doing a lot, a lot of that in the future in this let's play. Because it's just something that I never get sick of. Like, that's what I do in my personal copy. I just go through the Elite Four over and over and over again to get to get get some level ups on my Swampert in that game. And I don't get sick of it, because that's my way of, of uh, training. Anyways, I, I kind of, for some reason, I thought he was sending out Whiskash first instead of Waylord, but that wouldn't have ma made any sense, because that's not how it works. He always sends out Waylord the, uh, at the very beginning of the battle. So, yeah. That was just my mind playing tricks on me. Anyways, one shot! Waylord is dead. I don't care how fat you are, you died in one shot thanks to Vol Volster's Thunder. Next up is Gyarados, we'll stay in. This, this song is so epic. I love this song. Guys, man, seriously, I even... I love, like... This song is so good. It's like my childhood. When I first heard this song, when I was like 11 years old, I was like, wow. Actually, I think I was just 12. But I was like, wow, that is an epic song. And I still think that to this day. Almost a decade later. Alright, Betty. Betty White. Hyper Beam? Nope, Earth Earthquake? Dude, if I were you, I would have used Hyper Beam. I mean, that would be uh, definitely a lot smarter. <laughs> I mean, I, I know you would have to recharge, but you're not going to live anyway. Actually, I shouldn't say that, because if Bullet Seed only hits twice, then... Okay, no, you're, you're definitely going to die. Okay. Okay, we're good. No problem. My low tick... Uh, we haven't seen Mudstorm yet this video, have we? We've seen a lot of Volster. Okay, we'll go, we'll go over to Mudstorm. I'm, I, yeah, I think I mentioned this the last time, like, the first time that I battled Wallace. But, um, like, first time I battled Wallace in this Let's Play. But the first time I, like, when I, I was battling Wallace, oh, like, the first time I ever battled him, uh, like, nine years ago, I... Always could never get past Lodicolo because I would just use Swampert and Lodicolo would just use Double Team or Giga Drain. Like, he, Lodicolo would use Double Team, I, I, all my attacks would miss, and then he would just use Giga Drain and I would die in one hit. And I could never get past Lodicolo. And I remember the first time that I did. The first time that I ever actually killed Lodicolo. I still don't actually remember how I did that. I'm not sure if I was using, using different Pokemon or maybe I just got lucky. I don't remember, but. I remember I actually killed Lodicolo, and I was like, dude, I actually might beat him. And then I saw Milotic, and I was like, crap, what the heck is this? And my friend, um, Zero Xerox, actually, told me, uh, yeah, that's a very dangerous Pokemon. And, uh, yeah, I kind of got destroyed by it. And then that's when I came up with, um, that's when I actually caught the Pikachu and got a Raichu and got to, like, level 65 and then destroyed this guy. Now I have no problem with this guy at all. I, I always make sure I have a flying type for Lodicolo. This guy is... He's still annoying. And you know what, actually? It would have been smarter to go to... Nightmare, because Nightmare has Aerial Ace, but whatever. Yeah, actually... That's not really fair to Nightmare, because Emily literally was in the entire battle against Drake. So to send her out against Lodicolo, it's not really fair to Nightmare, but whatever. And we'll use Dragon Claw. And you're gonna miss! Nice! All right, you know what? I might switch to Nightmare anyways. I'll give it one more Dragon Claw. There we go, okay. 
Oh, sir! Wow. Okay, you know what? I am switching. Yeah, I am switching. I'm just getting impatient, and I don't think... Because he's probably gonna... Are you gonna heal? Actually, hmm, you might not heal. Yeah. <sighs> this Lodicolo is, like... Oh my goodness, it's like... It's gonna be the- this Ludicolo is gonna be the death of me. Like, it's- like, I have nightmares from this guy from when I battled him when I was 11. Or 12. I think I- yeah, I- I don't remember. I think it was just around that time. STOP USING DOUBLE TEAM! I GET IT! YOU DON'T WANT ME TO ATTACK YOU! STOP IT! YOU DON'T NEED TO KEEP USING IT! Like, it's overkill! I'm not gonna attack- I'm not gonna hit you now! You don't need to keep using it! DUDE, WHY ARE Seriously! Yeah, I hope he realizes that if once Emily dies, I'm going right to Nightmare, and I'm gonna kill you. Ha <laughs> ha! One HP! That's what you get, you idiot. Alright, that should kill him. Are you serious? Wow, right, so we're both on one HP right now, pretty much. That was so stupid! You used Double Team like ten times in a row, and then once I got to one HP, then you used Surf! What's the matter with you? You might as well just use double- you might as well just use double team again. Like, you are stupid. And now he's gonna heal. Cause he's, he's in the red. Okay, no problem. No problem because you're- all those double team- all those turns you wasted on using double team doesn't matter for me right now cause I have aerial ace. So, joke's on you bro. Yeah, the, the joke is on you. Use double team, I don't care. Oh wait a second. You can't because you're dead! That's what you get, you freaking loaded colo. Man, after nine years of you taunting me with that stupid double team and your stupid Giga Drain, that felt so freaking good! <sighs> I'm sorry, guys. I really hate that thing. I really, really hate that loaded colo. It just goes back to when I was 12. Like, that thing is just an irritation. Even to this day, like, that just proved that this, that, that thing still irritates me. Oh my gosh. That Lodi Colo still hates me after all these years. Anyways, Tentacruel, no problem. Adios. There we go. I think I, did I have an easier time... Defeat. Did I have an easier time killing that loaded color the first time? I think I did. I don't really remember, to be honest. And this part is kind of long, so we'll just spam A. I don't need to read the text, because I already did that before. Oh, May, you're late again, as per usual. Yes, I've finally done it. Where the heck have you been? I beat this guy in November. What, so Wallace is, is just in love with this room? Dude, it's literally just an empty space. But yet again, I guess that makes sense because Wallace is an empty space too, so... Yeah. I mean, come on guys, let's be honest. Like, Steven is was such a cooler champion. Like, Wallace? Like, really? Like, he just... He's just a weird champion. I mean, he's unique, but he's not really a champion. Like, Steven seems more like a champion than Wallace does. But I do like how they change the champions between between Ruby, Sapphire, and Emerald. Anyways, that is my beautiful team. I love I love this team. It's been a very good team to me over, uh, over the last few months, and uh, we have a lot more adventure left. And yeah, I can, I'm just holding on B because this is how you, how you speed up speed up through the credits if you don't have super speed. 
If you have super speed, then this goes super fast. I'm holding on B and super speed. So this is going like, I don't know, like 10 times as fast. Wow, that was like the fastest credits ever. And they're not even over yet, so I'm not really sure why I'm... Anyways. There we go, guys! I have defeated the Elite Four for the second time. Now, next time... Next time... I'm going to finally start catching Legendaries. So stay tuned for them. Thank you guys for watching, I really appreciate it, and I will see you all next time. PEACE!